Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night, and what's up? Hey everybody, I'm Naturally Stacy, and welcome back to my channel to all of my existing subscribers. And to all of my new subscribers, hello, sit down, get a drink, get a snack, and welcome to my MCM Vestos backpack review, and we gonna fill it out. Okay, <laughs> all right. So, if you guys wanna know, what I feel this lovely little backpack with on the weekends. Stay tuned. Okay, well, as you guys saw a few weeks back, probably like three or four weeks ago, I think, um, I picked up this beautiful MCM Vestos side studded backpack from my favorite place, Fashion File. If I can't get to any of my local resale shops, Fashion File is my spot. I'm so bad with Fashion File now. I'm on every day looking at the new releases to see what's going to be the next bag that I'm going to pick up. And well, I already ordered a bag and I got one coming next week. So if you guys want to see what that is. Give me a thumbs up below and uh, talk to me below and let me know if you guys want to see that bag. But we're not going to talk about that bag right now. We're going to talk about this bag. Okay. So this is my weekend bag that when we're out running errands and things like that, I carry my backpack because it's a little bit easier to carry for me. My hands are free. I can do everything I want to do. But throughout the week, this uh, right now, currently, I am carrying my my 3.1 Philip Lim large black Pashley bag. Um, you guys have never seen this bag. I picked this bag up at, oh my goodness, Women's Closet Exchange, uh, which was here in St. Louis. They, um, they've closed since um i the last since i picked up this bag i grabbed this bag has it been about three years now about two three years i've had this bag and it was a pickup that i never thought i would ever get um i always liked it i always thought it was a nice bag but i never i don't know it was just one of those things i never thought i would end up getting and then i got it um what happened oh quick story there's always a quick story my sister lisa who is she says i'm a bad influence on her and I, she's a bit of a bad influence on me because i'll tell you why i'm at work do -do 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 -do, work 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 like i always do because that's what i do and she sends me a message on instagram and says isn't this the bag that you've been looking at and it was this bag and i was like Oh my God, yes, I love that bag. So that weekend, she's like, let's go out there. And I'm like, okay, fine. So we go out there and the bag was still there. It was in a case. It was at a ridiculously wonderful price. And I had to get that. And I actually picked up a pair of sunglasses. Yeah, my Oscar De La Renta sunglasses I picked up there. And I was just like, okay, I'm good. I got I got the Philip Lim Pashley. I'm good to go and I carried it. I've been carrying it on and off since I bought it, but recently I picked it back up because I was like, I need an everyday bag that's black. And instead of me buying one, I said, let's go through the collection. And I found the Philip Lim Pashley and said, yo, let me throw this, you know, let's fill it up and let's go. So I uh, put down, I um, sat the coach um, turn lock hobo, set that down and went to this. So, in this bag right now is all the things that I carry throughout the week. Now, you guys have seen me show you guys what's in my bag when um, the Gucci, the Miss Gigi um, tote bag. But I have scaled down since that bag because this bag is not as big as that one. So, let's fill up my backpack. All right, so I'm going to show you what's in my Philip Lim right now. <laughs> normally this, a lot, some of these things are not what I normally carry in there, but we're gonna just see. Of course, the first thing you see is a pair of gloves. So right now I just threw my gloves in because I had, I caught an Uber home today cause we got snow again. 
every weekend we've had snow and it's been really annoying so here's everything that's in the bag and of course the first thing you see are a pair of glasses so let's put let's move some things out and let's get ready for the weekend shall we okay this is the weirdest angle but we're gonna make this work okay all right so as you see here is my backpack and here is my Philip Lynn Pashley. So first thing I'm going to pull out are my sunglasses. I'm going to put those in on the side here. The next thing I have in here is my little cosmetic case and we're going to slide that in right here. It just goes right in the bottom. Next, I'm going to pull out my wallet and of course the purse falls. There we go. Next thing I'm going to pull is my wallet, my um, Louis Vuitton Genie wallet. I'm going to put that in. We're going to stand it up. Next thing is my coach card holder where I keep all my extra cards. And I'm going to put that in the slot pocket right here. If you guys can see, there it is right there. Next thing I'm going to grab is some packs of tissue. You always, me, I always have to have at least two packs of tissue two packs the word is at least even though I'm probably gonna have more than that next thing I'm gonna grab is my hand sanitizer this is from Trader Joe's I'll slide that in also on the side and actually now I'm just gonna put it in the middle and I'm gonna grab my Nivea hand lotion cuz I need that you know cuz I can't be ashy cuz I had to make sure I put a little lotion on before I did this video <laughs> So let's see, next thing I'm going to grab is my cord. We're gonna put that in. Oh, actually you guys, I think you guys can see somebody right here. <laughs> I just realized there is someone you can see. She's kind of blurred out. She's a little blurry there. And I think the last thing I'm going to put in is my extra battery charger. I actually got this from Fat Fit Fun, and this is for my phone. I'm going to put that in the pocket with the tissue right there. And last but not least, pack Tic Tacs because you can't walk around with stank breath. So, And that's it. That is all I am putting in this bag. Oh, wait. Set of keys. Just in case we go to my mom's house, I like to have my keys. And that's it. That's all I'm gonna put in this bag. Let's see what's left over in this bag is like two more packs of tissue and a little manicure set that I carry every day in case I like, you know, get a hangnail or, you know, a chip a nail. I have another pack of, I have my nail clippers. Also, I have a extra set of headphone, corded headphones. Actually, there's two sets of headphones in here. The old style and the new style headphones from Apple I have in here, but I'm not taking those with me the, over the weekend. And that is all. And we're gonna close that back up. It's a little hard to close when there's nothing in it. So, but there we go. That's all closed. So I'm just gonna sit this next to me. And that is all that's in this bag. Also, if I felt like it, I could take my iPad, which I have carried my iPad in here before. Um, sometimes in the front pockets, I would put like um, another card uh, case sometimes in there too, but nah, I'm not doing that today. That is all we're putting in this bag. Okay, how do I feel about this bag, you might ask? How do I feel about this bag? Well, I really love this bag. I think this is probably the best pickup so far for the year. Um, I, I, it was funny that I was never a backpack person. I think I said this in the um, unboxing video. I never thought I was a, a backpack person, but I've always carried tote bags, especially on a weekend. My weekends are like, let me just I'll throw everything in a tote out the door but the thing is is like during the holidays and things like that when you're going to the mall people do get you know people get snatch happy so or they get handsy and put their hands in things and stuff like that so 
that's why carrying a tote around that time was not a good thing so i would try to get you know carry my crossbodies and a lot of crossbody bags that i have are very big and when i got this bag i was like okay i do have to still kind of be aware of people behind me and people being too close but sometimes i would carry it just with one strap so it's right next to me and the bag is really nice it's very versatile i love the color this color can actually take me into spring that's what i like and it's funny that i'm wearing light pink and this is it's, the camera is picking it up as a hot pink it is really a coral color and it, but it's really more of a coral color and even when i took the picture with my uh, m uh m2k uh mk2s i'm sorry from nike it still picked up pink and it's really weird how that happens but that's okay i still love it uh like i said i can take this into spring that's one of the good the best things i love about this purse is this is something that i can go into spring with and then i can transition into the next bag with this or also this could still stay my spring every day my spring uh weekend bag instead of me using a tote which i'm still going to use my totes i love my tote bags all of them um i have several tote bags i thought about doing a video of just totes and i have a few <laughs> it's pretty crazy i have a few tote bags but this bag like i said is very i love this bag it's versatile uh, you can't dress it up that's the only thing you cannot dress it up but that's okay i'm not trying to dress it up um but i love it it was a great price so i had to pick it up and it's funny that i actually thought the bag was smaller um on the mannequin the bag actually no the bag looked bigger on the mannequin so i'm like oh crap this might be a little too big but when i got it I was like, wow, this is a perfect size. And it started me on this path of looking at smaller bags instead of getting a bigger bag. So uh, you might start seeing some smaller bags floating around in my collection. We shall see. I do have some small, medium to small bags, but this is a bag I'm so glad I picked up and I love it. As soon as the weekend comes, I'm switching into it and I don't get out of it until Monday morning when it's time to go back to work. And that is it for this video. I am going to get out of here. Uh, let's see. I need to order food and it's, um, what time is it? It is 614. I think the snow has slowed down for now. Um, we're going to, we're supposed to get some more snow tomorrow and some more on Sunday. <sighs> I'm tired of snow. I'm tired of wearing snow suits. I'm tired of snow, but whatever. If you guys have any questions about this bag or any of the contents in the bag, talk to me below. Like I said, I have scaled down so you guys can see a few different things like my eyeglasses are not in here, which sometimes I do carry my eyeglasses anyway. So like I said, that's it. I'm going to get out of here. You guys have any questions, talk to me below. All my social media screens were at the very beginning of this video on this side, actually. So I'm going to get out of here. And I keep saying it. And I haven't left yet. So I'm going to leave now because I'm really hungry and I need some dinner. So love, peace, hair, beauty, tech, fashion, luxury, and all that fun stuff. Bye.